South Carolina has had a bad experience with bigotry and hate. We want to move forward, not back. And everyone here, as your next step, can you contact Senator Tim Scott? The voice for peace, justice. So if you like to join us for Saturday at any time. Testament. But you know, everyone, all all major religions have a golden rule, and that golden rule is about treating others the way that we want to be treated. It's about empathy and compassion. And what happened this last weekend was not didn't show much empathy or compassion, did it? No. Yeah. So I have We will not allow them to leave children at our doors to go hungry, to go without health care, to go without an education, peace and protection. I had just this one message for Mr. President. Please. Slave people make some noise. God's children make some men. Drop his words on you. to make a difference to stop this this is fear fear is what has caused this to happen and people like Donald Trump have preyed on that fear so people who are afraid of Muslims or immigrants or just people who are different than them it's not that they're a bad person they just don't understand and you can be the person to help them understand but first you must do you everything in love into action you need to be the light that shows other people what they should be doing there are ways to do that. The Lutheran Services of Carolinas does refugee resettlement. Volunteer with them. And if you don't have time to volunteer, donate. Donate what you can. Give your winter clothes away. We all can give more. Give your time. that an authoritarian government that's in power, that's trying to divide us, well, it's backfired because he's breaking us together. Talk about picking out those companies online that carry Donald Trump's clothes, but it's about those politicians in this state, like our governor, well, like the governor, that supported Donald Trump. And all those businessmen that support all these politicians that support Donald Trump. That's where the rubber meets the road. They have to feel some pain. And you have to pay This is about how the world looks at us. This is about how we look at ourselves. We are not what's coming out of the steam out of, out of the Bannon White House. We got to push back against this whole idea that the only people that can rule that and run this nation, as we're seeing with this White House, I'm sorry to say, a white man. We got to stop this.
This is about the diversity of America. That's a problem. We got to be on this job, be putting pressure on this government every day, every hour, as long as it's in power. Yeah. Power. Yeah.